apostles mm -hmm. of Christ. Mm -hmm. And no wonder, for Satan himself transformed mm -hmm. himself mm -hmm. into mm -hmm. an angel of light. Mm -hmm. Therefore, it is no great thing if his ministers also transform themselves into ministers of righteousness, My God. whose end will be according to their works. Their works. Maybe say it, okay. if you would, for just a brief while. I would like to speak to you from this subject. The devil in his best dress suit. The devil in his best dress suit. You know, there have been many misconceptions and lies told about what the devil even looks like. Come on, Doc. Come on now. And, you know, the thing is, we need to stop fooling ourselves and telling our children these lies uh -huh. of a non-fictional character. We have created something that does not even really even exist. Right, right. And I say that because if we say that the devil is this red creature, then we have lied. That's right. That's right. If we are saying that the devil has horns on his face, we have the tendency to walk around with our heads down. Some of us, some of us, some of us even keep our eyes closed just to keep from talking to people. My God. Some of us keep a frown on our face so that people won't approach us. My God. We get mad and ready to fight when another church member tries to tell us something that will help us. Uh huh. We get out of, we get out of church and go home mm -hmm. and get right on the phone. Don't even get a pastor time to leave the church before you start the rules again according to the scriptures. That's right. That's right. Yes, we are saved by faith according to John 3 and 16. Uh -huh. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. That's right. You see, the father gave his unique and beloved son to die on behalf of sinful men. That's right. Uh -huh. False teachers are adding works and law keeping to grace. Yeah. Uh -huh. You see, this happened to the Galatians in Galatians 3, 1 and 3. Paul points out their error in their teaching. In Galatians 2 and 21. You see, uh -huh. the devil's arguments sounds so convincing, sounds like a higher standard of holiness. Uh -huh. he, he really keeps being saved by grace through faith. Yes, the devil is, he is, he is subtracting the message of the cross, right. meaning that he is denying the truth. Yeah. Uh -huh. Satan temporarily deceived Peter about the cross in Matthew 16 and 23. Uh -huh. Peter took him and began to rebuke him by saying, Be it forth from thee, Lord. Jesus turned around and says unto Peter, Get yeah. thee behind me, Satan. Yeah. There are some folk who just don't like the message of the cross. Some folks say the message of the cross is just too violent, just uh -huh. too bloody. Well, well, as I get ready to take my seat, I would like to I would like to let you know that the cross is the only way toward home. That's right. Yes, yes, you must understand that if Jesus never went to the cross, if he never died on the cross, we will still be running around in our sins. Uh -huh. You see, in today's time, Satan is attacking more and more Christians at a rapid pace. He is, he is causing controversy among Christians. Mm -hmm. Satan workers appears to be righteous, the ones, you know, the ones who are keeping up all the chaos in the church. You know, the devil tries to divide and keep chaos among the children of God. So it is important, brothers and sisters, that we stay in the word of God. So that we will be able to recognize the devil when he approaches us in his best dress suit. You see, you see, to defend the devil, we must Give, give one another. Resist the devil when he appears in his best dress suit. Take him to the cross where he was defeated by Jesus. The day, the day is coming when Jesus will uncover Satan. That's right, that's right. And he's gonna let us see him for who he really is. Uh -huh. yeah. You know, the devil is known as a trickster. That's right. 
You know the best trick that has ever been performed? He performed it. He made the world think that he did not exist. Uh huh. That's right. And many people nowadays are still falling for the same old trick. Uh huh. That's right. Yes, yes, the devil, he is a destroyer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Every day he is trying to destroy the message of the cross. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, and he is a wolf in sheep's clothes. That's right. You know, this is when he is dressed up in his best dress suit. Mm -hmm. When the devil is dressed up, sometimes he will come at you as a family member. Uh huh. My Lord. Yes, Lord. Uh, sometimes he will come at you in the form of a friend. My God. My Lord. I hate to tell you this, but sometimes he will come at you in the form of a saint. That's right. My God. Uh huh. All right, all right, Rod. All right. Yes, he is a roaring lion. That's right. Mm -hmm. According to what the Bible says, that he is seeking who he can devour. But um, but let me encourage you to put on the whole armor of God. Come on, Doc. Come on now. Yes. So that uh, we will be able to stand and be ready to go to war with the devil. That's right. Yes, um, we must gird ourselves with the truth. Yes, sir. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, we must put on the blessed plate of righteousness. That's right. it. That's, That's right, right Doc. And uh, we must shod our feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. That's right. That's right. Uh -huh. And uh, above all, we must take the shield of faith, the helmet of salvation, yeah. and the sword of the spirit, yes, which sir. is the word of God. That's uh -huh. right. Come on now. So that uh, whenever Satan approaches you, you are able to stand and fight against him. Yes, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, and um, when he comes to you talking this whole nonsense, My God. you know, you can recognize the work of the devil because it's always something negative. Oh, yeah, yeah, and um, tell the devil that Jesus died out there on the cross for you. Uh -huh. Yeah, and um, he might agree with you right there. Yes, he died. Yeah. But, um, don't stop talking to him. Let him know that he didn't stay dead out there. That's right. Because uh, one Sunday morning, he got up. He got yeah. up. Yeah. yeah, and uh, you will be a living witness of how the devil will flee from you. Yeah. Uh -huh. So um, I don't mean to hold you no longer than a hell. Yeah. But I must let you know that um, Satan is going to attempt to get in every one of our lives. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah now, as long as you are dressed up in the armor of God, yeah, yeah you'll be able to stand against him. Yeah. Right. Well, uh, I just want to thank God for all that he has done for me. Yes, sir. Yeah, because there was a time when Satan was dressed up in me. Oh. Yeah, and, uh, if you can name it, I have tried it and I have done it. Oh Lord, and, uh, I thank God right now for being who He is to me. Yeah, and, um, maybe I know one who serves Him with my heart, my mind, and soul. Well, uh, if I am, that's all right too, because I tell you, when He told me, "Son, I have a job for you." Well, um, to a lot of folks don't know. Gave God my heart at the age of six. Yes, I did, and um, but I went on through life, y'all, and I didn't get baptized until 1997. Yes, yes I did. Yes. Um, I joined Zion Progress. Yes, I did. Preach on Sunday morning. Yes, sir. We have 45. Yes, sir. Pastor Ford here preached a sermon in time. Who's gonna untie your shoe? Hey, 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 hey. I never will forget it because. When God came into my life, yeah, and I experienced a change in life that I've never seen before. And to this very day, y'all, I want to say thank you, Lord. And I say thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. But He's done so much, so much for me. Yeah. I'm talking about me now and my relationship with God. Yeah. That's all.
that I can stand on. Uh -huh. yeah. You know what he did for me. Yes, sir. <laughs> he keeps me day in and day out. <laughs> Thank you, Lord, for that right there. Yeah. <laughs> he puts food on my table day in yeah. and day out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he gave me a mother and left her here with me. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Amen.